and information about the Affordable Care Act itself. Edie? Well, Kelly, right now, thousands of women across the greater Sacramento area are getting ready for a fun and inspiring day tomorrow. The first ever Capital Region Women's Conference. And the woman who's kicking it all off is a familiar face to our viewers. Lisa Oz, we see you often on the Dr. Oz Show, appearing with your husband. And your new show just launched. It's the Lisa Oz Show on the Freya Network. People may not know that you also help launch Health Corps along with your husband, Dr. Oz. And it's a nonprofit working across the nation, but the headquarters are are based in Sacramento. So first of all, nice to see you back in town. Let's talk about your keynote speech tomorrow morning. What's your message for women in this region? Well, I am so excited. The conference is focusing on health and, and wealth, but I'm going to look at it through the lens of energy and balance, time management, connections, and growth, because I really do think that it's all about committing to growth, shifting your focus, and making those choices that can improve your life, really transform your life. For people watching right now do you have one concrete example of something they could do tonight to get that moving uh, I have a little quick exercise right now look around the room take three seconds look around the room and notice three things that are blue um, almost the whole room <laughs> <laughs> close your eyes and list one thing that was red very hard to do so the point of that exercise is just to say that what you focus on is your reality. When you focus on what is positive and good and empowering in your life, that will be your reality. Kelly's belt. <laughs> Very cute, Kelly. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tomorrow's conference features everything from a yoga class to a panel on finding balance. I'll be leading a discussion on moderating this called Stepping Into Your Power. Why do you think that events like women's conferences are important? There are similar events all over the country. Well, I really do think that we as women are coming into our own right now. We are embracing our power. We can shift the, the direction of the whole country. Um, we're controlling more and more finances as in households and in industry. And really in terms of health, we are the chief medical operator of our of officer of our homes. So I do think that the more that women become empowered, the more information we give them, the more that we will see a shift in the positive direction. Let's just finally talk for a minute about Health Corps, a national service organization, and again, the headquarters in Sacramento. You're in a lot of Sacramento schools. What are the goals of this organization? Well, the goal is to make obliterate all childhood obesity and make America healthier. And we give kids the tools of nutrition, movement, and mental resilience. We give them tools of, to cope with stress in a positive way so that they are aware of their health, they change the health in their families, they change the health in their schools, and hopefully change the health of our country in the future. So bringing it home and bringing it into the neighborhood. Absolutely. Lisa, I look forward to your keynote speech tomorrow Thank morning. You. Thank you for joining us. And it's not too late to get tickets. If you'd like to attend the conference, they are still available. You can buy them at the door. I'm told if you want to do that, show up right at 8 o'clock. Again, the conference from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. You can leave your high heels at home. This includes a yoga class. We have much more information on KCRA.com. Should be a wonderful event. Lisa, nice to have you here at KCRA. Well, coming up tonight at 10 and 11, I owe...